very fine, thank you to God. I'm called as like a island from Ethiopia. I'm doing my work here in Atawasa University as a physics lecturer. I'm requested to do this for energy work, work energy problem. Can we do together, my dear, please? Look, the problem says a body has moved from its initial position at origin along its axis to a final position x is equal to 5 meters under the influence of the force given by f is equal to 4x along a direction and then newton what the work done by the force in moving the body from its initial position to its final position very good now solution my dears as we know work is equal to simply f dot s and then cos theta. As what we have discussed in our earlier discussion, or already we said to be a work done in the force, and then the displacement should be parallel to each other, and then the angle should be between them should be zero. If so, the work done could be simply Fs. Very good. But this will be true. In the case of constants, never variable forces, but this force is variable. It varies within the distance. And here's what you have to do to tackle such a problem, to do such a problem. You have to conscious, okay? While doing such a problem, it seems to be very simple, but it requires some consciousness. And as my dears, since this force is not a constant force, since it varies within each okay, displacement, we have to use an average force. Why for? Because the force is not constant force. The force which acting upon the object is not constant force. It varies within x and hence. You have to use f is equal to an average force dot x. Look, and then this becomes, okay, this becomes, ah, uh, this becomes zero or simply the initial force plus the final force and then over two times x. But the initial force at the origin is zero. Just substitute here zero in terms of x. And then be in mind what you have learned from the dot product of the vectors. And now since the distance, the direction of x and the f tends to be the same, i dot i is one. Don't forget, i dot i is one. And then look here, zero plus. And then the final f value, just substitute here five. Four times five is 20, okay? 20, five i dot r is one, so 20 is simply 20 newton over two. And then times five newton, this becomes this becomes, look, 20 newton over 2, 10 newton. Now 10 newton times 5 meter. Newton meter is joule, 10 times 5, which becomes 15 newton meter. And then which becomes 15 joule. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget. Like it, subscribe it, and then put any comment up on the box. Thank you. Bye-bye. Thank you.